What up YouTube, it's Paul. I'm back with something a little bit different today. I'm actually going to do the 20 pack bundle break of, of a bundle, that's a little redundant, but for the uh, USAF Heart the tournament, the pack and play tournament, where you just buy a 20 bundle, and that's what you got to go with. We got to make a lineup out of this. So, let's see what I get. This is also for posterity to make sure nobody scams, but I figure I might as well share it with you guys on YouTube as well. Now it's going to take a little bit um, because I have to write down the players because I, I, I didn't start a fresh account, so I have to write down who's available. But we'll talk through the packs. So let's hope we get something good. Man, if we could get something lit on the topper, that'd be great. I've never gotten anything good this year. All silvers all the time. Come on. All silvers all the time. All right, so I'm just writing them down between pitchers and hitters. I can figure it out after that. We'll build the lineup. All right, pack one, let's go. At least give me some lit bronzes if you're not gonna give me dope usable cards. All right, that's a little something with the Miller. So Ryan Jackson, some of these guys I'm gonna have to write their full name because I'm like, who? Steve Barron, like I legitimately never heard of Steve Barron. And I write about baseball players for a living. Never heard of Steve Barron. Never. David Rollins. Chris Coughlin. All right, so, yeah, sorry about that. A little bit long with having to, to write them down, but I got to make sure. This Miller will make the rotation almost certainly, unless we got amazingly lucky, which we're not going to. Man, if we can just get one diamond, I don't care who it is. All right. All right, that's something. I mean, there's some stuff. I'm talking myself into it, y'all. Don't worry, Matt Barnes. Cam Bedrosian, I could see him being a player here. Um, Cause I don't think there are any restrictions, right? It's a, you get what you get and you go for it. There's no way they'd restrict anything. That'd be crazy. So uh, we can go with, you know, whatever we got. Bedrosian, I think, will make the team. Prince probably will as well. All right. At least we got a couple good relievers in the toppers. And a good hitter. Corey Dickerson crushes righty. So honestly, I was I, I didn't really cover the toppers because I was upset that there was only silvers, but that's not a bad group. It's not a bad group at all. Alright, John Hicks. Oh, I'll reveal them, then type them. Alright, Booty. Giovanni Soto. Giovanni Soto could make the team. I could see a situation where that happens has to happen. Jeff Manship could too, I think. Hell, Eric O'Flaherty might have to if we don't get any lefties. <laughs> could become necessity on some of these. Jason Hirsch. I, should I even write down John Hicks? What the hell's that? I mean, I've heard of him because he's a tiger, but still. All right, let's see what we got next. Ruben Tejada. Sean Zaraga, oh my god, oh my goodness, y'all. All right, let's see, Dustin McGowan, I can't see him getting used, although he might have good velocity, I don't know, I might have to look in on him. Ernesto Frieri could be at the back end of the bullpen. I don't think any of these other guys I'm gonna even consider really at all. Like, I have to get something better, I think. Johnny Giovatella. Sean Zaraga. Zaraga. Okay, and Josh Butledge. All right. Come on, Charlotte. Charlotte's here, my puppy. Bring in something good. Oh, Josh Butledge again. Charlotte, you did it. You're a hero. All right. We actually do have some things here, though. A Felipe Rivero. Jimmy Rollins and Yadier Molina in a pack and play 20, 20 and go sort of league. This might not have been a very, a, a bad pack, y'all. So maybe Charlotte, you're a genius after all. She's like, yeah, dude, I can't just pull in the freaking diamonds right off the bat. Why not? But Felipe Rivera, I think, is a he's a certainty. I can I can't really envision a scenario where he's not in. All right. Not a bad pack for, for, for nothing but bronzes and commons. 
MC Sills, at least. Herman Marquez, Paulino, Richard. I could see Paulino maybe making the rotation as, like, the fifth guy. I think he throws really hard. I think. I would have to check. He's a he's an up-and-coming prospect. So, um, he might have some raw stuff that I could work with. But we'll see what we get. That's very fringe. Jed Lowry, I could see making the team for sure. Brian Holiday. All right. Did I get Seth Smith? Yeah. Just making sure I'm writing down all these studs, y'all. Gotta make sure I log all these amazing studs. Charlotte, where are the good packs? Yansu Kim could make the club. Darwin Barney. I'm all set, dude. I'm all set. Jing Ming Wong. Sammy Solis. Yuli Shasi. You know, I think that's... Uh, the, the Kim is about it on this on this pack. Sorry. Typing Yuli's. Yo, iMac. I, don't want, I know what I'm typing. Don't try to autocorrect me. Jerks. Alright. Six Nick Jason Rogers. Come on. Silvers. Silvers. I'm not even being greedy. Just silvers. There's one. Yunjin Ryu. Okay. I mean he's gonna get in the rotation. I've pitched with Yunjin Ryu. He's not bad. Not great. But he's not bad. A lot of hitters here. Brandon Bournes. Uh, Adrian Hauser, not a pitcher. Or not a hitter, I mean. Shane. Robinson, and Spencer, Kaboom! What a name. And Austin Barnes. Austin and Brandon Barnes, the Barnes brothers. We have the equal number of hitters and pitchers right now through eight packs. We're getting something together here. Okay, hey, another couple potentials here. Zach Davies, Yasmani Tomas. I'm not a huge Tomas fan in real life, but listen. We're putting together a garbage bag team. We need some garbage bags. Francisco Pena. Connor Gillespie. Maybe you can hit like some crazy walk off. Or game changer, I guess. Stefan Romero. No, not Steven. Come on. Freaking iMac. I know what I'm doing. Uh, did I write down Bull Schultz? Okay. Cool. There's something in there. There's something. Okay, we're halfway home. We're getting some good, we're getting some stuff. Chris Owings. Uh-oh, oh yes, I thought that's who it was. Let's go freaking Hanley. Now this is a card. By the way, I kind of love this because like it's so scarce. You know, there's gonna be very few diamonds even in the, in the tournament. Um, it's so scarce that we can get really hyped on a lot of different cards that we would normally not really react to, so. This is pretty fun. Chris Owings. Don't sleep on Chris Owings and Johnny Peralta maybe making their way onto the roster, too. Oh, I know you're going to want to change that to Johnny. Come on, computer. Chill out. All right. Good pack. Good pack. Nothing on the pitching side with that pack, but we'll take the hitting. Okay. Booty pack. TJ Ramirez. Avisayo Garcia. I could see him maybe making it. Oh, God. How do you turn off autocorrect on freaking the numbers uh, program, which is their fake XL? That's so annoying. Like, just underline it like a normal computer program, and then I'll decide what I want to do. Yohander Mendez. I think he's a legit prospect coming up. And Wiley. Oh, Wiley Peralta. He could make the rotation. We do not have a lot of rotation studs. We got Hyunjin Ryu, which is a good one, but that's it so far. Hell, Chris Heston could make it. Oh, another sweet Stephen, Stephen Romero. Sorry, I had to take a drink there. <clears throat> Chris Heston, Chris Capuano. Oh, if Capuano was a uh, reliever, I could maybe see him making it but I don't think so. Corey Lubke. I actually pitched kind of well with Corey Lubke in BR. But that's a couple innings at a time, so I don't know. Right, let's go. Give me something awesome. This 
is what you thought when I said awesome? A couple decent young starters there, but we're getting a lot of those. So they, it might be a little bit pressed to make the squad there with Eduardo Rodriguez and Jose De Leon. But they've got some stuff. Like Eduardo, I think, would have a better shot. Jerry Sanders. Come on, Paul. It's Jerry Sanders, dude. And then Jose De Leon and Eduardo Rodriguez. Coda Glover. Andrew McCurick. And seen that name? Don't really know who he is. Oh, sweet Austin Hedges could be our backup. He has, he has good defense. Tom Murphy, fake player. If you listen to my podcast, you get that. What is this? Catcher Fest? Jeez. I know that was like a really funny joke when I said Catcher Fest. Sorry, I was so outlandish. Lisa. My goodness. We have like all the backup catchers in the world. Sick Tom Murphy. Bruce and Maxwell. Danny Santana actually could be a little bit useful, and so could Corey Knievel. Now that I'm looking at it after freaking out about the two backup catchers. Freaking out, not in a positive way, obviously. Oh my gosh. Guess Kelly Johnson's gonna hit fourth. I'm not even gonna write down some of these guys. I'm not using David Goforth and freaking, I'm not definitely not typing out Asher Wojcikowski. Get the freak out of here with that noise. Mike Freeman. Kelly Johnson. Yo, Jason Coates. There's no chance you're making the squad, so you're not even getting written down, bro. Sorry. You can go hang out with David Goforth. Oh, my God. Oh, I got the switch pitcher and Javi Lopez. Those are both potentially useful assets, one or the other. I don't think I could really roster both. I don't think that that's a great allocation of resources. Marcus Simeon. He could have some usefulness. I'm just going to write down Javier Lopez and Pat Venditti. Blake Smith, Matt Bowman. Don't think so, fellas. Four more. Four more. Ruggiano, Bianco Bar, Zitch, Stevenson, Eric Ibar, blah, blah, blah. Adam Duvall could be, could be good. That one, I can see him making the team pretty easily. Park. Justin Ruggiano. That Justin Ruggiano flashback card is not too bad, so he might have some usefulness here if he if he just crushes lefties. Which has always been his, his deal, so I wouldn't be surprised if that were the case. Tony Zick. Robert Stevenson. I think we have enough to not have to use Robert Stevenson, but I do think he has like really good velocity. Wish you could just hit triangle there and look at their stats. That's weird that you can't, to be honest. Zanino. Uh, Fernando Abad as another lefty. Uh, I'm not writing anybody else down except for, I guess, Zanino. Zanino and Hedges are kind of the same thing. Good defense, nothing else. You want to fix it to Mike Matuk? That's fine. I don't, I don't really care at this point. All right. Maybe Braden Shipley has... Oh, wait. He's a starter. Never mind. All right. We're getting there. We're getting there. We're getting there. Give me some... Let me spike something legit. Who's that? 83? Okay. Adrian Gonzalez. That's not bad. That's not bad. I'm not going to use you, Baldo. I'm just not. Just not, not, not. All right, Adrian Gonzalez, not bad. Adrian Gonzalez, Hamley Ramirez, pretty clear platoon. And Mariznick could be off the bench, useful speed and defense. Ryan Brett, Brett Hayes, peace out. Sweet, another backup catcher, that's cool. That's cool. Last pack, let me spike something amazing. Nope, sure can't. Two silvers, but one of which we already had. So, I mean, Brett Cecil's a nice, Nice play, but blah. Man. All right. Well, we're rolling with a lot of silves. I'm not writing these other guys down. Um, I was going to actually make the team on the video, but 
that seems difficult because I don't have these categorized very well, and I don't think you guys want to hear me like rustle through. Well, not even rustle through. It's typing. It's not like I'm writing it all down, but like go through all that. So I'm gonna cut it here. Um, maybe I will make another one, a separate one with the lineup building, and then kind of see how it is. And maybe if you guys want to watch that, you can separately. But I'll cut this one here. Thanks for watching. Peace.